Okay, Mark St. Peter, I'm going to be opening up some, a Panini Mosaic Prism, no sorry, a Panini Mosaic Hanger Box, and a Panini Prism Hanger Box from 2020. Um, so I got these a while ago, I haven't been filling them all this week, so, I find, well not a while, I got these earlier this week, and uh, I've been excited to open them, but I finally am not feeling crappy after the rest of this week. Um, I found these online. I think I'm pretty sure I've opened this before, um, but I don't know if you've seen me open packs like just single, like two packs that was tons of money. Uh, but uh, let's. This is last year, it's 2020, not 2021. So obviously you want to get um, a burrow, which I have in the background there. Uh, a burrow. I don't know about two anymore. Maybe. <laughs> It's really Burrow or Justin Herbert you want from last year at this point, right? Um, anyway, I, bu I bought these on eBay, and like I said, I think I've said many times before, you go to like Dak Daka World and David and Adams, and then you find and like I I, was, I haven't yet I've oh constantly going there, but I've yet to buy anything from there because I constantly find okay. Not the greatest thing for this hanger box. So this, um, I'm constantly finding they're like decent deals, right? But then if you go to eBay, you usually find them some the same thing, same product for a little bit cheaper. Um, but just be careful. Make sure it's not a break. Make sure it's and not, not just a pack from a hanger box or a booster box. Uh, make sure. And I, like I said before, I've only I only ever do it from people that have 100% review, like 100% reviews. So. Which is a little bit insane, but if I'm not going to get 100%, then I'm just going to go, I'll just go to one of those reputable sites. Okay, so I know, I don't know, uh, Prism last year, not a, people don't have a great reputation, it doesn't have a great reputation, the Prism from last year. Uh, I don't know. I guess none of the big pulls I've ever got has been in Prism, I don't think. So we'll see. We got here. Okay. Traquan Smith. And Aaron Rodgers. So this will be 20 cards. Christian Kirk. I was hoping they'd come in actual packs, but it's a hanger box. Aaron, Aaron Smith. So stuff that you would find at, I guess you'd find that at Walmart, but you're not finding the Walmart and the Targets around me. They have like the stuff listed, but I've never even when I've seen baseball and basketball cards, I've never seen. I haven't seen football cards since earlier this. Like I saw them one time this year, when I went, when they were. I just happened to be there while they were stocking at Walmart. Okay, PJ Preston, CJ Mosley. Okay, so for some reason a Peyton Manny, even though he's long retired. Golden Tate the third. So so far nothing great here. Uh, Tyreek Hill, a hilarious Dwayne Haskins, and carry on Johnson. All right, okay, finally we're getting into the pr hits here. Okay, so a green prism, Nikhil Harry, which I'm pretty sure he's become a bust. He had a decent, he had a decent 2020, right? But then 2021 has pretty much disappeared, or did he get injured? Uh, what else we got here? A Yannick Nagayu. That is a... I think that's... I can't tell if it's... I think it's an orange cracked ice prism. Alright, so we're not getting any... Uh, so far, no. Alright, and then let's see. A Dalvin Tomlinson. Cool. I think, again... Red cracked ice, and I think a thing maybe the reason people didn't like this year prism. I, it seems like the cut, like the actual cut of the, like the machine cuts of the cards was kind of sloppy. You see a lot of like stuff hanging off the side, and like not quite perfect cuts and stuff. So maybe that's why everyone is like kind of set about it. Let's see what we got next. Okay, here's a good hit, a George Kittle red cracked ice. That's a that's a good hit. That's probably the hit from this pack so far. Unless we get a numbered burrow or something. I have a numbered burrow. I like a numbered uh, 
Herbert. A Josiah Degura? Tight, I don't really know who that is. Okay, this is cool. A Brilliance Tyler Lockett. That's a cool looking card. And then a, then last one is a Kenneth Murray rookie card. And again, I don't know who... And look, these cards are like super lame because they're not even... It's not even trading camp. That looks like Pro Day or something. <laughs> Man. Okay, so... Not a lot of... Okay, so that was kind of disappointment. I guess that... I don't know. Uh... I think definitely the hits are the brilliant Tyler Lockett, which you never know with inserts what like what's a, what is worth something, what's not. Then a George Kittle, the red crack tight. That those are the two big hits. And then okay. Now the mosaic looks like the hanger box exclusive autographs, inscripts orange and red rookie scripts. So. so I don't know who I didn't read the thing of who the or who do the autographs, but like if any of the quarterbacks did the the rookie autographs, that'd be awesome. But I don't know. People don't like love. Um, I don't think mosaic is that as as a. I don't, know how, I don't think it's as valuable of a card pack as from what I know. But I really like the I just like the design of mosaic so. I'm willing to pay the same amount, because I think the designs are cooler than the base prism. Okay, this looks like a pack of playing cards. Interest, that's kind of interesting. Uh, but again, hanger box, they don't come in individual packs. Okay. That's what we got here. Um, man, I'm trying not to... Uh, I'm trying to open it up without, like... I don't want to uh, like rip any of the cards or bend any of the cards, so this is kind of hard. Interesting. Okay. This is a very odd. I feel like I'm going to have to mess up at least the first card, bend it a little bit to open it. Yeah. Okay. I don't get this. They're like shoved in there. I don't think this is like a. I don't think this was a great design. I really feel like I'm gonna damage a card or two getting this stuff out of here. Okay, here we go. See, I just like really like the base design. Darby James Jr. Oh, nice. A Jerome but the bus. Jerome Bettis. That's a cool card. He was one of my favorite running backs back in the. I guess not not that long ago. Well, I don't know. Depends on how old you are. If you're as old as me, it doesn't feel like that long. I don't know. Why am I not center? Sorry. Okay, Adam Thielen. Okay. Bobby Wagner. Jordan Hicks. Philip Lindsay. Devin Singletary. All right, another um, Boomer Esiason. Another old guy. Okay. Oh, cool. Look at this. A Jerry Judy rookie card. Nice. That's a good hit. This is the third old guy. <laughs> Terrell Davis. What? I don't know. Okay. A Tyler Johnson. Or I think that's orange reactive rookie card. What is going on with this pack? An orange reactive Curtis Martin. I don't. I really don't. This. All. These are all like. Well, it's, it's like the fourth retired person. That's bizarre. Okay. Um. Jeff Saturday, I think, also retired. Okay. Warren directs Jeff Saturday. Okay, NFL debut J.K. Dobbins. He uh also Warren reactive. Sorry. Okay, a got game Michael Thomas. Nice. Oh, okay. A flea flicker Cleveland Browns card. Um, I don't know if that's. I don't know what. I don't know what you call that. Uh, pair, pair, color. But if you see, it has 
Nick Chubb, Baker Mayfield, and Odell Beckham Jr. So this is a card that would have been worth something if, uh, you know, this supposed offensive power, offensive uh, dream team were had worked out. Okay, and Michael Pittman Jr. Not bad. Oh, nice. Justin Herbert, NFL debut card. Sweet. That's a huge pull. Oh, a Justin Jefferson. I have quite a decent collection of Justin Jefferson stuff. By accident. And then a Hall of Fame Brian Urlacher. Okay. Um, let's just look at... Uh, I, guess I, should put, I don't know. Let's just look at the, the old guys. Hall of Fame Brian Urlock. Oh man, Gerald Davis. I so I guess the best pick. I guess the best thing of the old guys was Andrew Eiler like the bus. I guess technically this is the best pull because he, it's the Hall of Fame one, not just a base old retired guy, which is bizarre. And then, I mean, we pull. This is a, I mean, a Justin Jefferson rookie card, a Jerry Judy rookie card. And then, this is definitely the pull, the NFL debut of Justin Herbert. Nice. Um, and then all these orange reactives, and then one Michael Thomas insert, I think. I have annoyed. I don't know how to, uh, because, uh, you know, Dobbins and Tyler Johnson, who knows how the career will be. And this is just, I think this is just hilarious how they, this was going to be a really expensive card in the future and then they that kind of imploded yeah i don't know i guess the i mean jay i don't know of all the orange reactive cards who knows i have two two retired guys in there so but yeah this is definitely the pull of the night so that's cool all right so that's it for now i'm gonna be uh i'm, I'm maybe i'll buy something soon maybe next week or before the end of the year, but uh, I'm not sure when I'll do the next sports crunch. Hopefully it won't be so uh, stuffy. So anyway, next time, take it easy, everybody.